Control your Corsair IQ-enabled PC's cooling, lighting, audio, or even your IQ-enabled Xenion monitor. All through the tap of a key using the IQ Stream Deck plugin. In this video, we'll walk you through the actions available in the IQ plugin and showcase ways in which you can take advantage of the IQ integration with the Stream Deck ecosystem. Control your entire setup's lighting using murals and the new murals action. If you are unfamiliar with the murals feature, we have Corsair's guide on them linked down in the description. The murals action can activate a selected mural or cycle through a custom set of murals every time you tap on the key. It starts with two options, but click on the plus button to add more to the cycle. Next is the profiles action. With this action, you can set the profiles used in IQ. If you have two IQ profiles you wish to switch between, use a multi-action switch. In the first multi-action, place your first profile. In the second multi-action, place your second profile. Each time you press on the multi-action switch, it will switch between those two profiles in IQ. Activate macros, remapped keys, or other IQ assignments using the actions library. Choose an IQ action and tap on the key to trigger it through IQ. The Xenion action is for controlling settings of your Corsair Xenion monitor. Great for switching between picture modes for movies and games, or toggling the refresh rate overlay to quickly see games performance. Note that to control your Xenion display, it must be connected through its USB Type-C port and be detected inside of IQ. Control your IQ-enabled cooler with the cooling action. This can be used for activating specific cooling presets or switching between two. Select the mode, select the device, and which presets to use for that device. The sensors action adds a lot of utility to your Stream Deck. See at a glance, temperatures, RPM, voltages, and more right on your Stream Deck key. You have the option for changing cooling presets by tapping on the key or toggling between two sensors by tapping. The surround sound action is a simple way to toggle 7.1 surround sound processing on compatible headsets without needing to access any menus. Surround on. The microphone action is a quick way to mute the microphone on your Corsair headset. The icon on your Stream Deck key will gray out to show that it's muted, but depending on your headset model, it can show its mute status as well, such as on the Virtuoso. To be truly hands-free, this action works well with Stream Deck Pedal. The equalizer action allows you to switch to a specific EQ preset or cycle through the EQ presets that you have inside of IQ. Create your own presets inside of IQ and then activate them using your Stream Deck. Lastly, the NVIDIA broadcast action allows you to set the AI filtering used on your headset. This includes NVIDIA's famous noise removal technology and also echo cancellation. You have the option of controlling them independently or using both at the same time. The intensity slider is for controlling how strong you want the effect to be. Tapping on the key turns this filtering on or off. Thanks for watching. If you found this video helpful, why not give it a like and subscribe to us on Elgato Workshop to find out how to get the most out of your Stream Deck and other Elgato products.